Hey guys, what's up? I'm Mantec here. I recently just found my old iPod Nano 3rd generation and decided to plug it into the computer and this happened. I suppose it was because I hadn't used it for a while, but it isn't actually because of that. All the battery's gone, so it restarted like 5 or 6 times and then it finally came to this. When I hold, held down this, the center button and the play slash pause button for a few seconds. So I just verified that it, all my stuff was back and if I went into my computer, Pear's iPod, which is me, and I went down to iPod control, which is a hidden folder which can be shown in tools, folder options, view, scroll down, and you, it should be on do not show hidden folders and you will click on show hidden folders. You just click OK and this will appear, all these and a few more. Double click on iPod control, music and in these folders you should have your music. So I verified and my music was still actually here which I was really surprised. And if this does happen to your iPod Nano, all you have to do is this. This problem is actually extremely easy to fix, as all you have to do is hold down this and menu for like 5 or 6 seconds, and it will go back to your iTunes as it will relaunch the iPod from the beginning. All you have to do is, if this happens, which is on my end because I haven't actually synced this iPod to this computer, I will just do transfer. No, I won't. I won't. I'll do don't transfer because I don't care about the music on this iPod. And I will wait. I will click again. And now my iPod is connected. It is actually now syncing all my music from my iTunes onto this iPod. So, thanks guys for watching. And don't forget to comment, post, subscribe, whatever you guys like. And... Liking this video will help me out, so thank you guys.